Hello everybody, I'm Salvatore by Caremia Siciliana. Um, today we're going to talk, finally, uh, about the personal pronouns in Sicilian. Okay, so uh, let's give it a quick look and then I will give you all the peculiarities. Io, tu, iddu, idda, nuaci, vuaci, iddi. Again, io, tu, iddu, idda, nuaci, vuaci, iddi. Okay, so. Uh, the first singular person, you, nowadays is one of the most spread forms, but the first uh, singular person has a lot of different forms. You, you will never just listen to you. You could also hear eu, yeu, yo, you, io, ya, ia. There are a lot of different forms. Uh, of course, you always understand if it's a form of I, because it's usually, yeah, it's always put before the verb. First singular person has a lot of different forms all over Sicily, but nowadays the most spread form is you. Tu could also add the form tune since it's a monosyllable and Sicilian doesn't like monosyllables so when in general we have uh, a trunked uh, word or a monosyllable Sicilian adds the syllable ne at the end so we usually s uh, can hear to to <laughs> But you could also hear Tuni anyway. If you're new ear Tuni, you know that's the second singular person. The third person has just two forms uh, and not three in like in English. Why? Because well in Sicilian we have two genders and also objects have a gender in Sicilian. So when you talk an example about a bottiglia, bottle, bottiglia, you will refer to it as a feminine object. If we are talking about a cutieddu, knife, cutieddu, we're talking about masculine object, okay? So we have just two pronouns, iddu for, for masculine, sorry, and idda for feminine. Uh, among the third person, there is also the polit uh, form, that is, like Spanish usted, or English you sir, or the French vous, that is vos and is used with the third singular person. So, if I say vos e auto, I mean you sir are tall, vos uh, nowadays, also a uh, form taken from Italian is enough used that is lei, lei è avuto, but vasia is actually the the real Sicilian form. Then uh, nuaci we and vuaci we have are two compound uh, words. They are made by noi or voi, plus auci, like Spanish nosotros and vosotros, that could be translated as we other, you other, you usually don't say that in English, of course. So they're not the, un the they're maybe the most spread forms, but you could also hear to just noi or voi. Voi is more used as a polit form, but it's not that used like vosia. Vosia is more used than voi. And, uh, and nowadays, also lei, we have already said, is used like vosia. Uh, Nuaci and vuaci 
have a lot of um, variations too, like you. So you could also hear to Niagi, Niandri, uh, Nuyauji, Nuyaji. There are a lot of small variations, but you always understand that it's we or you, plural, okay? And they, and then we have uh, iddi, just the plural of iddu or idda. And it's used for both uh, masculine and feminine objects and person. Okay? So, again, uh, we, if we want to summarize a bit all the forms we have said, we have iu, ia, io, io, you, eu, yeu, etc. for the first person. Tu. Tuni for the second, iddu, idda, vossia lei for the polite form, nuaci, niaci, niangi, eh, nuiauci, vuaci, viauci, viangi, voiauci for you, we and you, and then iddi. Okay, guys, uh, that's all for this time, and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.